today our video is a fresh look into spring. Yep, we're going to feature some hairstyles and some DIYs. We hope you guys enjoy! So to start off with the floral headband, you're going to need a headband, some flowers, hot glue, gun, and a glue sticks if you need them. Then we're just going to take the flowers off the plastic stems. And I picked these cute white daisies. Next, you are going to hot glue the flower to the headband. And when I glued mine, I separated them about an inch apart. And then you're done. Feel free to add as many flowers as you like. Now I'm showing you how I would wear it. So I'm just going to brush my hair, make sure it's very smooth. And I'm adding a little hairspray to help the headband stick. And then I just like to put it over and smooth out anywhere that looks a little rough. Next is the turban style headband. You will need any type of fabric you want or can find. So first I start off by cutting out a straight piece of fabric and this can be however thick you want it. If you want it thin, then you can cut it thinner and if you want it thicker and bunchier, then you can cut it thicker, which is what I did here. And now I'm just brushing my hair to the side, just preparing it for my turban. And then, you're just going to take the turban, and I just like to hold it straight up like this, and then put it behind my head, and then you're going to cross it over once, and then cross it over again. And you can either tuck it to the top or to the bottom, or you can go ahead and uh, sew it or glue it or however you would want it to put it together in the back. For the next DIY, you need some construction paper, a jar, some scissors, and a black pen or marker. So first, you're just going to just like tag how much paper you want by putting in some ink marks. Now you're going to cut all the way to the other side of the piece of paper. So after you have that, you're going to tape one end over probably like the ugly part of the jar with the residue glue and you're just going to tape it down with some clear tape. Just roll it around and just tape the other side. Now you're just going to design it. Design however you want. This one is going to be concert ticket money jar. And these are your finished products. Now for a makeup tutorial. This is going to be a springtime makeup look with pinks. So first you're just going to conceal the eyes. I also use this kind of like a primer so I put on top. Go ahead and put an extra amount right on the eyebrows and the bridge of your nose. Now you're going to take a cream color and you're just going to line the underneath your eyebrow. Now you're going to take that same cream color and put it on your 
eyelid. Now you're gonna take a little rosy pink and you're gonna put it on the entirety of your eyelid. Now you're gonna take a brighter pink and you're going to do the crease and a little smoke. So I just go from the corner of the eye and just swipe in towards the crease. You don't need to define the crease, just make it a little messy so it's cute and a little girly. Now for the eyeliner. So we're going to do a, take it a little simple. So you're just going to tight line underneath your eye and then do a small wing on the end. Just go with the shape of your eye. Don't try to do more. Now time for mascara. So I have this new trick with mascara that I just close my eyes and I do mess like I do the little heavy coating so that I don't get mascara all over my eyelids and it's actually working out for me. And you should try this out too. finished your eye makeup. Time to move on to the eyebrows. You're going to take the gel from your eyebrow kit and you're just going to oh, swoop with this with the spoolie first and now you're just going to outline your eyebrow and glue it in. Do whichever way is comfortable. Don't make your eyebrows too sharpie like and you know just make yourself feel pretty. You take a pink blush and you're gonna put on the apples of your cheek and swoop upwards. Now, this is the finished makeup look super cute, super pink, super spring, and this would actually be a pretty good idea for Easter, so go ahead and try it out. Like and subscribe and have an amazing spring season. Bye!